My favorite music artist would have to be Drum roll, please. get to know me so without further ado let's get into the video so all right so my first question is what is my dream car so i'm not even gonna cap to y'all my dream car initially was a lexus 2020 but the jeeps Then they came a long way, and they got the technology that I want. So I'm more so leaning toward a Jeeps 2020, but by the time I get my dream car, it'll probably be 2021. So we'll see what's popping by then. But it was between Lexus and Jeep, because that's what I like. What's your favorite Nicki song? So I'm not even a cow. I love Nikki when she was Itty Bitty Pinky. Like, Itty Bitty Pinky will always be my all time favorite because she just fits so effortlessly that it was just like you, you just, you just could not, not fuck with it. And that's a double negative. When you fuck it with a double negative, impossible. So, <laughs> right there off the top, like, Itty bitty piggy, and it was like, hold on, let me play it one time for the one time because I need y'all to understand. You was in New York, you was fucking a Yankee, I was fucking a face, I was fucking a Frankie. You can't give some try like that. So yes, itty bitty piggy is my all to, my all to. Like that's when I fell in love with Nikki, but after that I don't know what happened, so I'm gonna leave that where it's at. Um, next question was, what is your fave Doja Cat song? Um, I want to say it's, yeah, so my favorite song is Juicy, and it's only because, like, she actually was juicy in this video, like, you keep it juicy, juicy, I hear that on it. My first encounter with her, bruh, I was so, I was so like, what? Would you like more kids? If so, how many? Oh, so I would like more kids. How many? Um, how many? I don't know because like before I had my son Jaden, I really wanted like a house of six or above. So like low key, I wanted a house of like ten, not including the husband, the wife, the dog, the cat. So I really wanted a big family because it's not something that I ever had growing up, and I do have. An older sister and a little brother, but we were so far apart that we all grew up the only child. So I did want a big family, however, where I'm at now in my life and with Jaden self sufficient, that's getting a little scarce, but it's not a far reach. Um, I do want to leave a legacy, and with my mom passing down her business to me, I, I want to have another woman in place to pass it down to that's going to create another legacy. So, honestly, I do want more kids, but I don't know how many. 
whatever God bless me with, I'm just have to deal with because I'm in mean, it here. So, can't debate with that. Where do you see your life in the next five to 10 years? I am 25, so the next five years, I'll be 30, I'm retired, <laughs> period. <laughs> YouTube ha has done taking off, you know, my son would be goddamn what ten? If I was to have a newborn after that, they'd be. So yeah, my newborn would be going on six, self-sufficient. So um, traveling, <laughs> I'll be Marie with me. Eight day. Okay. What advice do you give people who want to start a YouTube channel? Don't waste your time. sorry I'm not sorry I don't know why I said I was sorry but no for real like YouTube is overpopulated over concentrated everybody's doing what you think you thought was special so unless you're coming in here with something unique unless you're coming in with with hard work ethic don't waste your time because YouTube is something that you have to do constantly every day all day and the thing that really knocks people off of YouTube is you do it for about a year and don't get paid. So YouTube really needs to be a hobby in order for you to enjoy it. Like when I started it, it was a hobby. I was going to school for editing, I was going to school for videography, like YouTube is just something to do. And when I started getting subscribers and low key subbies slash fans, it was like, they fuck with me. Your girl is the key. Hold on. So it really made, it really motivated me. It really got me to seeing, you know, to see my videos hit over a thousand, to see my videos hit over 20,000. Like, it really was a job. And to see, like, you have me monetized, monitor all your stuff, and I had a check waiting on me, it's when I was like, oh, this could be a job. Okay, hobby, giving me a check. You know, it really motivated me to pursue longevity. And then I have people wanting to do brand deals and other stuff starting to come into play. So, unless you have something different to bring to the table, don't waste your time. Because if somebody would have told me this when I started, I would have started differently. You know what I'm saying? Or I would have done stuff better so be mindful of what you're doing be mindful of what you want to do see what's out there do your research your upbringing and all about your life okay so that's not a really a question so i could take i guess i can give y'all like a synopsis slight pull up if you go back and watch my story times <laughs> you'll get a better understanding of what my upbringing was however I grew up sheltered. I grew up where money wasn't an issue. I grew up where if you did what you're supposed to do, what you wanted wasn't a problem. Period. It's all I'm gonna say. Next question. How old are you? Okay, so if you don't know, now you know. Check your girl out on Instagram because how old I am is on my Instagram. I recently just posted a ton of pictures of me being what? What? Comment it and it got my thumb low. What? Only real subbies know because you follow me on all platforms. What? Thank you. 25. I posted a whole bunch of pictures. With these big ass, pink ass, 25 balloons. So, how you don't know that? Okay. Next question. Favorite food. So, um, if you haven't noticed, your girl is not your typical average size YouTuber. Which I don't give a f because I like to eat. And I like what I like. So, the question was my favorite food. Let's 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 go down the list. Are you ready? Are you ready? 
Your girl like macaroni and cheese, fried chicken, fried pork chops, rice, um, shrimp, any kind of seafood that's crab, mussels, um, crawfish, scallops, fish, tilapia, whitey. Um, I love to eat hush puppies. Mind you, even though I'm big, I like vegetables. Broccoli with cheese, um, carrots with a little bit of sugar, sweet peas with a little bit of sugar, um, green beans with the bacon in it, because if it ain't got bacon, it ain't right. With, if my grandma make it, with the neck bones, because that be the shit that got the gravy with it, so you got to add it, drizzle on top of your rice. Um, let's see. I love me some french fries with the season salt, add queso cheese. With a snippet of bacon. Um, I love me a burger, but the burger gotta have cheese, jalapenos, pickles, a fried egg. Like, uh, oh, oh, how the fuck I forget collard greens? Collard greens with the egg bones with a hot sauce and some rice. That shit be busting. Um, next question is, if you could, if you could collab with four YouTubers, who would it be? So, I'm willing to work with anybody, but the main YouTubers I would love to collab with would be Nick and King because they're the most relatable, they're the most transparent, and to me, like, they're the most real, honestly, honestly. On oh, my dream vacation, so my dream vacation would be honestly it'll be between India and England because I really want to see how England lives because you know how they say like England is right sided versus no hold on when I get in the car it's on the right side okay so England is left sided versus Americans is right sided. So I would really love to go to England and experience their lifestyle. I love India because of their culture and just to better understand why they do the things they do. Um, so my dream vacation will be in between those. What are my goals for this year? So my goal for this year is to hit over 5,000 subscribers. Also, um, to get my dream computer, which is over $3,000, so your view matters. And also, to have a new baby, like, one of my goals is to have another child. I'm super excited. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna leave that for what it is. So, those are my goals for this year. Um, who's your favorite music artist? Um, <laughs> um mm, that's a good one. My favorite music artist would have to be Jump Roll, please. Megan is dying. Cause it's it hasn't been one song that she's dropped that I don't fuck with. Or her with so up top Megan Stallion am I the queen of YouTube you know you guys have given me that name and I've come to understand to accept it because I am the queen of YouTube like who else to do it better than it's your girl with sweeties, baby. So, I am the queen of YouTube. I am your upcoming YouTuber. I am the newest thing popping. So, if you ain't with it, then what's stopping? Like, period. Jump on the train and get left. So, yes. Alright, you guys. Thank you for asking me all these questions and wanted to know more about me i am super excited to touch 5k because like i said when i grow we grow and we are a family so thank you so much i love you subbies and i will see you in my next 
video. Peace.